Hmm. So what we have here is the chicken that I barbecued yesterday, the two half of chickens left over. And I had put a roast beef and potatoes in my crock pot last night. So what I did was transition the potatoes into this pot with the chicken and this little roast beef down in there. And I'm about to put it in the oven for a little while. Let it do what it needs to do. Not long because everything is done, but I don't know. I think I want to change the texture a little bit. And now I got to figure out what to do with this boneless chicken. It's done, like more than done. It's like stringing apart. So I'm thinking about um, cooking some beans and putting them down in his juice and making some chicken chili for my son. And he can eat nachos over the week. We still got some roast beef down in there. I'm going to um, wrap my mind, Google some things. Because I really want to start cooking things I've never tried before. Um, and that's what's going on here. I could add carrots, but I don't want to. I'm just going to leave the potatoes in here. Um, like I said, that's a roast beef. These are the two half of chickens that I had left from yesterday's barbecue that we didn't touch. I ate steak and I had chicken legs in there and um, some potatoes. I put some peppers on that and I'm trying to think now. I'm gonna need y'all to give me some ideas. Um, one thing I got in my pantry over here that I have a lot of and I can't commit to making anything out of. Um, Excuse my language. And chickpeas. What am I going to do with these? I really don't eat out of the can, so this don't go empty. I just have this for, I don't even want to say emergency purposes, but emergency purposes. But I have chickpeas everywhere, and I don't eat chickpeas. So I need to figure out what I could do 